I just arrived at a boat landing here in west central Minnesota and uh, you may have noticed the hat. I actually fished with a couple of fellows last year. We did a show, Dustin Carlson and Super Dave Williamson. They're both guides here in Minnesota. We had one of the best shows ever, probably the best show ever as far as visual activity. The only problem that I really saw with the whole thing is that uh, I didn't catch any muskies. I actually caught one nice walleye, so Gary and Keith would be proud of me, but uh, no muskies. Those guys like cleaned up everything in front of me. I'm telling you, they, on a serious note, they really are two tremendous anglers. The only problem is when you're in the back of the boat behind them, they don't leave many scraps behind. But this particular deal is a little different. We're on a really deep lake here. We're gonna try some deep water stuff, hopefully deep weeds, more of a plastics bite, where the old guy in the back might be able to scrounge up a fish or two. I think I can get it done. No, and this skunk hat that I'm wearing from last year, I'm hoping to be taking that off and replacing it with the pink hat here shortly. We'll show you the next bite. Just looking for the next bite, next bite, next bite, next bite. Just looking for the next bite. As often in fishing, the little details surrounding a bite can make all of the difference. Those who are up for analyzing and sorting through these details, especially when conditions aren't ideal, at the very least are giving themselves a fighting chance for a successful day out on the water. We've got a lake that's got a lot of deep water, a lot of deep forage out here, and we're setting up quite deep. The boat position is gonna be in the 22 to 25 range, and then we're working some deeper weeds kinda on the base of the break. That's where we're gonna start out trying to pattern things. There's, there's weeds all the way down to like 22 feet of water here in different patches, so plastic baits mainly we're starting with, but anything that'll get down there a little bit. We wanna let the baits sink a little bit, hopefully get into or right over those weeds, work them back slow, and we're just gonna try a variety of things maybe some deep spinners that type of thing as well and we've got shallower options here too more of the primary break if we have nothing here deep we may go in and hit the primary and maybe cast both ways but we're going to start out deep here first and see what's going on knowing the lay of a lake is pretty important for narrowing down your choice of lures but there isn't any substitute for time on the water which can reveal information such as bait fish hot spots ideal foraging areas for an apex predator such as muskies we just pulled up to this spot. The root beer float. Uh, the spot's been really good all year. For some reason, it's just had a ton of bait fish on this break line. And uh, we weren't here for more than five minutes. We were all kind of working our soft plastics and, you know, looked over at Pete and he, his rod buckled over. When it first hit, I didn't think it was much, but he might have. I'm ready when you are, Pete. Oh, well, he's not ready. Pete said he had one on, and all of a sudden, the fish just right at the side of the boat, his rod was doubled over, and I, I knew Pete had a, a nice fish on. He wasn't sure what how big it was, but I could definitely tell it was a nice fish. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice fish, <laughs> nice <was> cool. fish. <laughs> nice work, man. Yeah, just a weird hit, man. Yeah. Just a tick on the, I was, I was rising up, and it just, when I let it settle, it was thunk. Right on oh, the pause? Good. he's off the bait, perfect. I love a yeah yeah definitely on the pause. Got a little girth to him. Yeah, nice oh, fish. That's a fatty. Nice fish. Well, that fish was pretty deep, guys. I'd say. Oh, boy, look at the girth on that. That is a tub. That is going to be a mean nasty someday. Actually, it already is a mean nasty. It's got the attitude. <laughs> yeah, it does. <laughs> Add about uh, 30 pounds to this guy. And state record time. <laughs> We've been eating, boys. Her belly's full. Yes, she is. <laughs> she nice goes. work, Pete. Yeah, got the skunk out of the boat. Nice First day. one of the day. Uh, yeah. The next bite is brought to you by Mercury, number one on the water. 
Amsoil, the first in synthetics. Tracker Boats, Fish, the finest. Bass Pro Shops, your adventure starts here. Berkeley, catch more fish. Mustang, stay sharp longer. Lawrence, find, navigate, dominate. Motor Guide, never stop. Strike King, number one in fishing lures. And Power Pole, swift, silent, secure.